this video, we're going to take a look at how to measure soft plastics. There are essentially three scales to measure plastics. There's the Shore double zero, which is the hardness scale to measure rubbers and gels. There's the Shore A hardness scale, which measures parts that are not quite so soft like gels, but not quite so hard like super hard durable plastics. That's gonna be your more flexible rubbers. Slightly soft, but not too soft. Slightly hard, but not too hard. And then finally, there's the Shore D hardness scale, which measures the hardness of hard rubbers, semi-rigid plastics, and also the hard plastics. Today, we're taking a look at the Shore A hardness durometer scale. This is a Shore A durometer. By pushing zero, you're gonna zero it out. This little tip right here is what you use to actually get the measurement that you need for the plastic that you're measuring. So let's take a look at this Maker Faire pencil. Let's measure the rubber hardness. Again, we'll get that zeroed out. And as we push, push down, we know that it's about 81. Now again, this is the Shore A, Type A. Let's take a look at this this big pencil eraser. Oh, now take, take note, if you try to push it in and you're triggering, triggering a movement, that, that'll give you a false reading. So I'm gonna hold that down. Now I'm pushing it in. 75. What else do we have? Oh, cool, we have this Ryobi handle. Let's measure this handle. 72. We have this tape measure. It has been around the block a little bit. 66. And this is a sample I just pulled. This sample is actually a silicone material. And it's also about 70. Interesting. So there you have it, folks. Using the Shore A drometer to test different soft, yet not too soft, plastics.